Well, we continue to learn more about the horrific crash out in West Texas earlier this week that took nine lives, including a Central Texas native. Six News reporter Bailey Bates is live for us in studio tonight with more on this investigation and also how a young coach is being honored. Good evening, Bailey. Good evening, Chris. The driver of the passenger van carrying members from the University of the Southwest golf teams was the head coach, 26 year old Tyler James, who was a Colleen High School grad and many say passion radiated from him, especially when it came to golf. He was passionate about golf. He was passionate about teaching golf. He was he was passionate about coaching. 26 year old Tyler James's joy for the game came to a close Tuesday after he was killed in a fiery crash in West Texas, along with eight others. James was in his first season as the head coach of the men and women's golf team at the University of the Southwest. They were heading back from a tournament in a passenger van when they were struck head on, killing seven of the nine in the USW van. The driver and passenger of the pickup truck that crossed the center line were also killed. A 13 year old child was behind the wheel of the pickup truck. A spokesperson with the National Transportation Safety Board says the front left tire of the truck, which was a spare, failed, veering it to hit the USW van. They are loved ones to us. They are members of our family here uh, on campus. I can't, you're going to hear that word over and over and over again. It's the Mustang family. We truly are a family. James's family expanded way further than USW. He's a product of Colleen ISD, where he graduated from Colleen High School in 2014. A community where his family is deeply rooted with both his parents being coaches and teachers for the district. It could be where he learned his leadership. He would help anybody, everybody that wanted, wanted anything to do with golf. I mean, young, old, it didn't matter. Troy Drummond was James's golf coach at Howard Payne University for three years. He says James taught him more than enough. The desire and the passion that he had taught me that whatever I had was not enough. I needed to do more for him. I needed to do more for this team. Um, and that's something I'll always remember. James followed his dreams in becoming a coach, with one of his stops being East Texas Baptist University. I can't never say I've had a coach quite like Coach James. He uh, was really unique in the way his style of coaching, his way of talking to us. I could tell he really cared for us. His passion once again radiating, and that's something everyone who knew him is trying to live on. And I know that he would want us to succeed, and I think if we work hard, we can continue his legacy that way and show that passion that we have for this great game and and just you know a passion for life and, and a passion to teach and and the passion to, to help people the tyler lee james memorial golf scholarship has been established with the clean isd education foundation in the young coaches honor if you'd like to donate head over to our website kcntv.com we have instructions for online and in-person donations